Welcome back to the hockey show. Oh, it's not. My, my biceps oh, I mean, just did, yeah, did there you go. Oh, oh, yeah. That's a little better. Now it doesn't work like that. <laughs> Welcome back to the hockey shop, source for sports, folks. We're down here in Goalie Utopia, where Cam has decided that the uh, you know those little Bauer footballs that they put inside of the gloves when you get a new Bauer glove. It's always kind of cool, you know. Sort of the glove wraps around it, helps helps form the palm. I guess Cam figured I needed a little bicep help, so we inserted a couple in the uh, the undergarments. The undergarments are what we're talking about. Cam's got the uh, the leggings on. I might go find something uh, hard and bang on his knees. I've got the top piece on. The beauty is, this means they've got them back in stock. For the longest time, these were tough to find. I've got one of the original sets with the yellow padding. Um, it's been three years now. It's being held together uh, by duct tape and bailing wire, as they say, but I still need it. Uh, so the fact you've got this now back on sale at the hockey shop, thehockeyshop.com, is very exciting to me, and it's going to be exciting to a lot of the goaltenders out there who have been looking for it. Um, there's not much to sort of say here, Ken, but walk me through. There are a few changes in this one compared to the other ones. Well, I removed my right bicep. You walked me through. <laughs> so, uh, yes, these these elite padded garments are, are, are here in the shop. Limited offering. Um, get them while you still can. Um, they are quite difficult and still fairly exclusive to get a hold of, to be honest. Um, big highlights, definitely the knee padding itself. Change from those older uh, Bauer padded garments that you saw before. Um, used to be the Poron, now it's their Flexor material, although it is basically the same chemical makeup in terms of for foam wise. Um, still a soft density foam to the touch, but upon impact becomes rigid uh, and realigns to create that uh, impact protection. Um, definitely not something that I would say is like a replacement for knee pads, but it's a great complement um, to a set of knee pads as well. If you're looking for a little bit of extra padding as you are dropping down into that butterfly, um, this just gives you a little bit more of that absorption, especially for the impact on your knees. It looks like they've, they've removed the padding on the inside of the thighs that used to be there. Correct. I mean, your pants are really covering a lot of that. Plus you're getting a lot of double up in terms of depending on the knee pad that you have as well. Um, but it also looks like there's a lot more wrap in the knee pad. Whereas I know that was what you really had to position the old ones and make sure it was set up with sort of like two sections. This one looks like it really wraps around that knee nicely. Folks said. It helps. It's not about sort of protecting you from pucks, although it wouldn't hurt. As Cam said, you probably still have another knee pad over top of it. It's more about that drop impact uh, and absorbing some of that impact, preventing some of that from transferring up into your knees, avoiding a little wear and tear, making it a little more comfortable. Uh, but to be honest with you, like I love it there. I can't live without it here. And we do, you know, a little bit. We get questions every once in a while at Ingle. Uh, do some consulting with some coaches every once in a while. They'll have a, a young goalie or a junior goalie that is having problems with, you know, feeling pucks in the ribs. I know a lot of you out there still like to wear chest protectors that are super mobile, maybe slide towards the mobility side and less on the protective side. Uh, we had a client moving into NA NAHL this year that was feeling, he had an older Vaughn chest protector that he loved, but he was feeling a lot of shots in the ribs. First thing I did was told him to find one of these. Um, this extra layer of protection around the rib cage really helps up around the collarbone as well. That can be the difference between a bruise and a break. Uh, really like the protection here. And then it's got, you know, it's the pants have spots for your socks. Um, it's got sort of, it's got a nice, uh, I don't know if it's a wicking material, but all I know is it kind yes. of seems to take the sweat off. Like it's a really good undergarment anyways. And then when you add the, I guess it's not pour on anymore, but the flex pour orb. on style, the flex orb impact, this stuff is gold. Uh, I will go get something hard and bang it off Kemp's shin pads here or knees to show you that you can't actually feel. It really does double the impact. So the fact you've got it uh, back in the store, Cam, tell them where they can get a hold of you and where they can get more information about uh, how to buy one of these. You can give me a call at 604-589-8299 or... 1-800-567-7790 or www.thehockeyshop.com. Oh, I missed. Oh, my God. It doesn't actually hurt except when I missed. <laughs> right? I'm out. <laughs> Check them out at thehockeyshop.com. They've got this Bauer Protective Undergarment in stock. Um, what a softie. He's totally fine over there. This stuff really does work.